Credentials, prevailing wisdom is he's gonna try to keep this fight standing tonight. He has to. You know, this is what got him to the show. It was being able to use the hands to set up the kick. We all talk about the high-level boxing background of this young man. But as he's developed, he's developed great knees. Yeah. He's developed great timing, great counter skills, and also the beautiful right high kick. The right high kick is something he eyes very well as he follows with a jab right hand, left hook. I can come over the top and he can put you to sleep. No doubt about it. He will try to put on a striking clinic once again here tonight. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed, it was the charisma, it was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's gonna look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes. would make him yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Our tale of the tape for this, our main event of the evening. Four years apart, some differences in height and reach as well. Here once more is Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC lightweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer. Making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Seattle, Washington, USA, Mr. Tenacious. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! You can give me your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it official. but on the other, truly a fighter who can do it all. And that guy will usually have the advantage on paper. When you're a striker at this guy's level, that will normally balance out whatever advantage the other guy has. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Ooh, big shot lands. Try to establish that jab. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. Let's go. Let's get that takedown now. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, nice kick right there. Tell the masses how, how good that feels to get kicked like that. Johnny does. It doesn't feel good to get kicked like that. Kick to the body by Lee. Let me see those kicks. 
just unable to quite find that range. Three minutes remain in the line. Sound defense there as he blocks the shot. Slips the shot. Ooh, head kick lands and he's hurt. Lee gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Under two minutes now to go round one. Oh, landed that inside leg kick. Already a welt on his opponent. Oh, nice right hand. Circling to his right. Powerful leg kick lands. That punch no good. One minute. Oh, nice job landing the knee there. He's got a lot of size for this division and put it to good use there. How good is that right hand? 30 seconds now to go in round one. Looping left hand misses the target. signifies the end of the round. Let's take us through some replays, champ. And the replays are going to be kicks. That's the story of this fight to this point. He is landing these kicks at will, just driving his shin into his opponent's legs, and it's really starting to slow him down. Ready to fight? Ready. All right, round two. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Whoa! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Lee going with the kick to the body, but unable to find the range. Ah, oh, that jab hurt him. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, hey. if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand, jab, right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit, finish him off with the uppercut, that is your soda. I mean, come on, man, let this guy have the whole thing. Big ball punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Oh, that right hand is on point. Three. Whoa! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Well, a really good second round for him thus far. After a somewhat lackluster first round, he has found the rhythm and found his striking range. Scary proposition for the opponent now here in round two. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh! Head kick lands. Strike there is blocked. Nice job by the defense. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh, big punch land. Whoa! He needs 
start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Got him. That was a thudding leg kick. Oh, that's a nice strike. And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, God. Let's check out some of the action from that previous round, DC, and what a display on the feet. Huge knockdown with that kick. Yeah, he's a high-level striker. He throws these kicks to the body, he throws them low, but when he goes up top, he's very powerful, and he can end anybody's night. The toughness displayed by his opponent allowed him to stay in the fight, but he cannot take many more of those types of strikes. Ready to fight? Ready. Third round underway. Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Lee. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Oh! He's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. A really good job by him there to raise the guard, DC, and block those shots coming his way. He does a great job of blocking all incoming strikes. Oh, slips to avoid the right. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Three minutes. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting him up now. Lee goes. Ooh. He's got him here. He loaded up there on that high kick. Punch lands over the top. the fight but don't ignore all the work he did with his hands and give credit to the opponent the opponent was in there every step of the way and in order to get a fight of the night like you got tonight both guys have to be willing to participate we send it inside now to bruce buffer for the official decision ladies and gentlemen referee heard beans call to stop this contest at four minutes 14 seconds of round number three declaring the winner by So there he is, the man of the hour. What a massive knockout for him to get this win in style tonight. He did everything he needed to do to find the knockout. Now he can celebrate with his family and friends as they earn this spectacular victory.